Good morning, everybody. We're actually out here getting ready to no prep salty at the Still City Shootout. It's a local no prep event that actually happens here behind the back of the track. So after the finish line, we're racing on the backside, which is on like bare asphalt, just like a street race. One thing with street racing is you don't want to do it on a, a radial. You want to do no prep racing on some slick. So I came and picked these up last night. Only bad part is I got to get those off and those on. So I got the car jacked up and get the wheels off and we're going to do beadlocks real quick. And we got a couple hours till it starts, so we should be okay, but I gotta get busy. Here, so we got the wheels off. We've been hammering on it. Actually, shout out to Josh for stopping by and helping me and his boy. We got these thrown on here, and uh, now I'm just going through, kind of tightening them down by hand, and then I gotta torque them to 22 foot pounds. So, super nice, and you just jerk the radials off of it, throw bias plies on it, and let it go. So, we're gonna uh, just use a little 12 point, and I've just been tightening them down. I like get real close to where it looks tight, like down to that little gap, gap. Um, this gap, I've been working these down a little bit at a time. And then I'll grab the torque wrench, we'll torque them down. So, we ended up doing the chip draw, and I got none other than Trevor that was hanging out with us out at LS Fest, parked right here with us. We were actually joking about it, now he's over here putting the suspension tune up in this thing to beat me, but um, we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> So uh, yeah, we were kind of joking about if we lined up or whatever and all that stuff. And here we are, we both got uh, third pair down and small tire. Small tire is like the last class running um, out of all the classes. So we got just a little bit of time. I'm gonna put a tune up in this thing. So hopefully beat this thing, Shh, don't tell him. But uh, now Trevor's gonna do it. I'm like, well, it sucks, but also it's kind of cool that I know at least one of us is going on to round two. And then we'll just help each other out and we'll, we'll do as much as we can today. Morning, princess. <laughs> they showed up, helped me throw some tire, some air pressure in the tires. We got them on looking good with them Hoosier babies. And uh, we're just throwing a tune up in this thing to hopefully be Trevor. I mean, honestly, I don't care either way, it's all good. But um, I just want this thing to go down. So I'm in here on the boost curve. You guys could maybe see that. Yeah, kind of, sort of. See AJ's ugly bug in the reflection. Hey. <laughs> so there's the boost curve. So as you guys can see, somewhere around 1.5, the boost could start coming in and then it's not it's seven or eight on it. So. This thing's gonna eventually have somewhere, if, it, if we have eight on it, it made a, it, it have a thousand horsepower in this thing up top. Um, and down low, it's gonna have about 600 horsepower in it. And then we're just gonna hope it ramps through there. Worst case scenario is if I'm a little aggressive on the tune-up, I can always just 80% throttle it or whatever. I don't have to be in full throttle the whole time. Some people think they gotta be full off, full off. You don't have to, you can, you can be 70% throttle down track. So if I have to pedal through it, I'll pedal through it. Um, I want enough in it to where I think it'll go decent, but I also don't want just nothing in it so it's not fast at all. So I think that's where we're at. I'm gonna load that tune up in the car, check pressures, look at everything once over, and then uh, wait for our call. AJ and I are heading up to the starting line. Yeah. We're yeah. gonna watch James go out there and tear it up on the no prep. Trevor, you're going down. Down, Trevor. Sorry. I mean, I love you, but. <laughs> we're trying to make our first pass. Slipping, sliding all the way down the track. <laughs> Woo! Feels 
good to actually make a good lick in this thing. It wasn't crazy fast, but more than enough power in it for the surface. But uh, all right, let's uh, pull that out, see how we see how that looked. But I think I think this is the drag he's correct from today. It went a 1760, 672 at 114. And uh, so yeah, not, not bad, not crazy fast by any means for the surface, but hey, it went down through there. Everything shifted, worked, everything's happy, so hell yeah. 670, not bad, not fast. Shoe didn't come out, it missed by just a little bit, so we need to trim that up. And now the brakes are real, real hot because I had to get on pretty hard because that end comes up quick. I was in it too long probably, but uh, yeah, back in the seat, feels good. Everything worked good, so we're okay. But you can smell the brakes right now. I can smell the brakes. Yeah. Yeah, those, those so, are a little ripe. So check out that run. The green line is full throttle. Uh, just barely into the run, got out of it, had to come all the way down to 20% and then slowly started working my way back in. And then at the very end, I got into full throttle just a little bit right in high gear. So uh, nothing crazy. So had a good mile an hour, but it was probably spinning honestly right there too. So we, uh, I'm gonna look over the data, get a game plan, adjust the boost curve a little bit, probably leave the leave the same since it's on wastegate and there's not much more I can turn it down on that side, but try to uh, smooth in the ramp from when it started to spin out. Hopefully the track comes around and it'll just take what I have in it. Woo, all right, things are happening fast. We uh, headed up for round two. Just smooth the ramp out a little bit. Left everything else about the same. I mean, I thought about pulling the power out of it, but it hardly has any in it. So uh, hopefully the track's a little better. Took a little air pressure on the tire. We're in the left lane now that seems to be doing better today. I felt really good. The car was pretty much hooked the whole time. I don't know if we got a draggy on that deal or not. Yep, 60 foot. Let's see. There's an eighth. 646. So it actually, I think, went slower that time. Felt faster. All right. Might have been a little off. 60 foot wasn't quite verified. It should have been. So 60. Eighth mile, 646. I think it went 617 the first one, maybe it was 670. Gotta look at that. It felt faster, it felt better. Gotta get the bigger shoe. Got another win. Got another win, babe. Good job. High five. Whew. Felt good. Parachute worked that time. That definitely helps us slow him down. Yeah? Yeah. Oh. Now everyone gets to pack a shoe. Oh. <laughs> Where's it going? I'm stressing out. But it's fine. I just want to okay. make, sure, I wanna make okay. sure that you're okay. safe inside I the car. I appreciate that. It's three people to do it, but April packed it, folded it, good job. Okay. It's, that's her new job between rounds. I really hope that it comes out. <laughs> she, I think she did pretty good, so should be all right. Uh, definitely need the shoot here, because holy smokes, that is not the longest shutdown, and that shoot definitely helps. So I think we're ready. Tune-up's in it. I went a little less on the bottom. A little more up top, so hopefully we're going to chase Hayden down. So I'm just excited to be back out here with Salty doing our thing and racing. Man, it's 
It's awesome. I'm excited. Yay. I'm glad you're doing something. I'm just glad to be back, and we're uh, we're making we're making rounds. We're going rounds. Yeah, and hopefully number three. number three. So after this round, it goes to somebody would get a buy. I haven't got a buy yet. Somebody would get a buy into the final. But uh, we got Hayden, and Hayden meticulous on YouTube. He's got a little RX-7. He's been doing no prep. He's been winning a lot, and he's going to be going real, real fast. So I threw what I think is the next step for this car to try to go a little bit quicker, and we just hopefully I nail it. So uh, give him our best run that we can give him. All right, guys, here we go. Round three. Like I said, we got Hayden. He's probably the fastest small tire car on the property. Actually, I'm pretty sure he is. I know he is. So um, let's see what we can do here. hard at this game we're in a brand new combo no excuses though he beat us we couldn't be happier with the combo i mean it's working we just gotta we just gotta do some playing and tuning and adjusting and stuff but i mean we're so soft on salty too once we get it dialed this thing is gonna fly i mean it's already doing so good so whew. feels good to be back in the seat though all right guys so i thought the first pass was 17 but it looks like it was 672 second pass 646 and then that one was a 639 at 119. So 119 in an eighth mile on a no prep. This car, the fastest it ever been on a prep was 126 mile an hour. So we are quickly creeping up on that and it's on no prep. Uh, the big thing like on that pass right there, 60 foot, 162, like in Vegas, we want a 140 something. And uh, I mean, that's like a 110 or 120 fairly easy. I know it will. So we're, we're we're doing it. I mean, it's doing pretty good. But uh, I mean, first time not thinking I was gonna come no prep the car 48 hours ago to going three rounds and racing the fastest guy and losing by I don't know a couple cars or whatever. I mean, it's quite a bit. But uh, hey, we we came out, we we did the thing, and we went round. So Salty's right back doing what it's supposed to be doing. We just got to uh, spend some more time dialing it in. But I couldn't be happier. I'm. I'm breaking stoves, so it's just uh, it's nice to see progress. We're we're making progress. We lost, but I couldn't be happier with how Salty's doing. So we're definitely making progress on this thing. Uh, everything's working super well. April's parachute deployed. <laughs> it <laughs> came job. out. Good job. It came out. So that's all that matters. So. I, it took a minute though to actually <laughs> plop out. Yeah. Well, the, as the car goes faster, it'll come out easier. That's so. what that's what Joey and I like, just. That's only a hundred and like. 20 mile an hour so yeah joey's like don't worry about it it's all about yeah. speed i just need to be i need to be moving faster and then you're saying yeah. come out that better. yeah oh, but it came out um so i mean i think it's slowing down but i look back at my dragging actually we started our first pass was a 670 something now we're down to a 639 so wow so we're making progress they, they keep chipping yeah. away at it so i i mean i'm happy it's good salty's back salty's back baby well, we're heading out of the track right now, and I'm pretty gosh dang excited. Everybody thought the car was really sweet. 
enjoyed checking it out and then uh, it worked really well and caught some people by surprise and also you know did well went a couple rounds we got some work to do but like Hayden that beat us he's been no prep racing his car the last two years pretty heavily really working on dialing this thing in and uh, he's got it figured out and he's doing really really well I know we have more than enough power to play with everybody it's just um, time and tuning at this point so which is the fun part so we uh, we'll we'll get her dialed in and uh, super super excited super happy with the results today super happy salty's doing its thing so do me a favor hit the like button for me share it with some friends if you know somebody that might enjoy this video help it get pushed out to some new people and uh, if you guys want to see more make sure you're subscribed I'll see you in the next video